us are. Father, I give you the praise. I give you the honor. The Bible said your word says we look up to you and we are lighting on our faces. We are not ashamed. Lift your hands high. Please, as you receive this prophetic word, if a word comes, even if it has a name, and that is your situation, you receive it. I see God visiting people tonight in mass. But I see a specific visitation in the medical field, visitation in the nursing field. Whatever be your challenge in your path of career, in the name of Jesus, sir. Lord Satapa, he showed me one yesterday so much reproach. You are meant to be a medical pro professional, but you are squatting with somebody. It's a shame, it's a reproach. What kind of situation is this? I command you under 72 hours. Your situation changes right now. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I take authority over the masquerade deep devil. Masquerade devil and central demons attacking someone's life. Uh, the name begins with a, 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 a chuku and then um, has a J after that. Chuku J something. Whether it's Chuku J or whatever. I, I, I prophesy to you that family altar, that masquerade altar, that ancestral demon that is resisted your life, that made life miserable for you, that has put the pressure physically on your body and that weight. I command it come back to hell right now. In the name that is above every name, I see a water spirit tormenting the life of a man with the name of OCH. Uh, that is, is part of the name. That water, that, that family altar from the stream that is tormenting your life and drawing you back, I declare it broken. And now I speak to everybody across the world. You dream and see masquerades all the time. You dream and you see yourself around the water all the time. I declare the powers of the waters broken right now. I declare the powers of ancestral demons. I'm broken right now. There is somebody asking for a license. I don't know the license or what it is. Whether it's a practice license, whether it's a mining license, whether it's a, a license for something. I prophesy today that license is released to you under the next 48 hours. Receive it now. And that contention over your land, I declare the contention is over. The contention, they are dragging the land with you is over. I see a Land that is that is more like a recreational land. I declare today that contention is over, and every other land they are dragging with you. Your property they are dragging with you. Your house they are dragging with you. Your day you have the original document, they have the fake document. I declare again under 48 hours, the matter is sorted out in your favor. Sciatica and all manner of terrible demonic pain from the left waist all the way down. That nerve pain be healed right now. The same person that had the pain on the leg is also having an affliction right in the head. I declare the healing right now. And if yours was just a leg only, be healed. Peptic cause disease, gastric or flux disease. Water brush, acid brush, epigastric pain, and all the chest pain all the way back. I declare it is arrested right now. Somebody shout the Lord and say, Amen. Somebody is a victim of witchcraft monitoring spirits. You have a pattern of dreams that you dream that makes you to know that they are monitoring you. Whenever something great is about to happen in your life, that thing happens and then it is arrested. I announce today that monitoring devil is arrested and sent to hell. That monitoring device is it's sent to hell. It's sent to hell. It's sent to hell. It's sent to hell. Monitoring devices. Monitoring mirrors. You dreamt that you saw like a mirror. Like a camera was just following you and monitoring you about. Tonight, I declare that camera is set on fire. 
Everyone connected to this altar, anywhere they planted a monitoring mirror, a monitoring device of God, even a human being that they planted to monitor your life. I announce today they are uprooted and released back to hell. In the name of Jesus. Somebody say louder, amen. Say louder, amen. Today is the end of that miscarriage, recurrent miscarriages. Someone has had up to three miscarriages, another about five miscarriages, another one very terrible, up to 12 miscarriages. Very, very terrible attack in the dream. You are pressed down. You have somebody having relationship with you. The next thing you see is the blood. I am standing here. God will give you a sign. That devil, that's it. That same circumstance you experience in the dream will try to recall again. But in this day case, you will, you, will, you will confirm their defeat and their destruction. Everything that says you should labor without reward, that you should have a portion of breakthroughs, I declare it is arrested. Pregnancy is restored now. You are bleeding. I declare the bleeding is arrested right now. About five months, four days there about. I declare the bleeding is arrested now. Another one, three months, the bleeding is arrested now. Another one, you you, 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 you are not expressing fetal, fetal movement anymore. Uh, about seven or eight months there about. I declare that the movement is restored now in the name of Jesus. Life back to that child. I take authority over stubborn spirit husband. Violent spirit husband. Managa, name starts with a V. Very violent, wicked spirit husband. I don't want to describe the brutality of that spirit husband. At times he comes as if he's an animal. I arrest, I set that devil on fire right now. Violent spirit husband that will not let you marry or let your husband, your relationship to work. They are set on fire and sent back to hell. In the name of Jesus, somebody, every time a spell comes upon you and you use your hand to resign your work and then you regret what happened to me. You've lost one, two, three. One has lost up to 12 jobs. You don't have a problem getting jobs, but you use your hand to resign. One of the people I'm talking to now, you are at the verge of resigning now. I break that devil in the name of Jesus. Another one, you're already grounded, you have resigned and you are regretting. On that 72 hours, the Lord will open another door to confirm that he has broken that yoke. In the name of Jesus. Say justice or justin. That is in this category. Or a Jude. It's a Jane. It's in this category. It is over. In the name of Jesus. Miriam. Lump in the breast. And any other person. See another Mary. Maria. Lump in the breast. Painful. Strong. Mers. Now. Receive fire. Every other person watching from all over the world. You have a lump in the breast or a tumor or a growth in any part of your body or a cancer. I declare it dries up now. In the name of Jesus. And I have a word for somebody that is a testimony heading in, in the direction of your house. A testimony is heading in the direction of your house. The meaning of that is what is coming will visit you in your house. That is, they will bring the car key and meet you in your house. A document of house and meet you in your house. And today, an employment letter is entering the hand of somebody today. This second day of February, and you are testifying later today that your job, another person's contract award in multiple zeros, more than six zeros, is released today. The right eye affliction is healed. You bought a stolen property ignorantly and it has implicated you. Right now, the Lord who knows your innocence sets you free now. Whether it was a stolen car, stolen, stolen property, stolen something. Now you are free. In the name of Jesus, you will testify. By this word, the charges are dropped. Your innocence is confirmed. 
in the name of Jesus Christ. And then your car was stolen also. Yours was stolen now. Now I declare immediate tracking and restoration. Hey! They will send for you and say that car has been found. Shout the loudest. Amen. They sent you a threat message. They say they have handed you over to them for elimination. They said they are killers, kidnappers. Another one said he's a herbalist. And he gave you his name, your name. Hear this now. Hi, my name is Professor David Costa, and I'm here today to introduce the University of Cali. Hear this now. The same persons, because they are going to have an encounter tonight. Whoever, whoever is threatening your life tonight they will have the visitation of Jehovah if you are saying amen shout the Lord and amen and they will send you a text message back I am sorry I apologize you are not the person I am meant to address hey oh, yeah, 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 yeah. everybody looking for you Jehovah shall look for them and they shall come back to you and ask for an apology for you. Shout the Lord and amen. It's a, sudden, it's a sudden change of life. Sudden shift. A driver. Suddenly you got a house. In a matter of days. Suddenly you got a car. You were a driver before. God orchestrated certain things. You are driving currently as a driver. God that is greater second things that can change your life. This is applied to several people, but there is one of the testimonies we'll take whose name starts with an S. Whether it is a boss who calls and says, Look, that's your house, that's your car, that's your property, or oh, whatever, there is an orchestration. And I announce to somebody here tonight, there is an orchestration that God is orchestrating. From one level where you are, he's shifting you to another level. Whether you are a messenger before, and he's taking you and making you a manager, whatever it is, there is a shift in level. You believe that, shout the loudest, amen. There is a Daniel that is experiencing that, there is a Jacob that is experiencing that, and there is one who has those two names, the Daniel and Jacob together, that is experiencing this shift. The devil tied you down for a long time and make your life a mockery, as if, it, as if you are serving God for nothing. And suddenly your life is being shifted. And what I say to one God says, I say to all, the devil has tied you down for a long time and made your life appear like a mockery. I announce to you today, Jehovah is shifting you up. Shout aloud, Amen. Receive your miracle job. Somebody all the way in Sokoto, this is your testimony. What I'm just saying now is your testimony. You are a victim of abandonment and rejection. Whether you are rejected by family or you are posted and posted out of circulation in the mind of somebody. Oh yeah, just abandon him there. Today, or abandon her there. Today, I declare something is coming to lift up your head. It's like the case of David abandoning the wilderness and nobody cares what's happening to him there. But promotion met him there. Elevation met him there. Increase met him there. I don't know who God is speaking to where the devil abandon you today your promotion your increase is meeting you and every expectation in your hand every expectation in your hand today is turning into your manifestation if you are saying amen shout the Lord and say amen if you are saying amen shout the Lord and believe us amen give the Lord a big clap and a loud shout of praise lift your hands high anywhere you are tonight in need of surrender to Jesus. Place your hand on your chest and pray this prayer after me and say, Lord Jesus, I am a sinner in need of your help. Come into my life and make me a new person from today. Forward ever, backward never. Thank you, Lord. In Jesus' precious name. Amen. Now stretch your two hands in front of you. You pray that prayer. Please link up with us. I prophesy of prayer upon your hands. Your harvest will look for you. What is yours? No devil shall keep back. In Jesus' precious name. Go on ahead and honor God.